All right, so we're gonna go ahead and jump into the training. We're just gonna go ahead and get the basics of everything set up. So I went ahead and I've set up a brand new Invoicing You account just to get started with everything. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and log in here and we're gonna do the initial setup. So in, this, in these next few videos, what we're gonna do is we're gonna cover all the initial setup. So the very first thing that you want to do whenever you log into Invoicing You to get started is you want to go to your settings and you want to go ahead and create and connect your Stripe account, all right? So that's the very first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do. If you don't do this step, you're not going to be able to use the platform at all because Stripe is what we actually use to go in Stripe is what we actually use to go in and you know capture the payments and and do all do all the the payment transactions. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and just share my screen here. And I've just logged into this brand new I've just logged into this brand new invoicing you account. I've clicked right here on this settings tab. So I've just went right here and I've clicked on this settings tab. And then what I need to do is I need to go out to the I need to go into this payout details. All right. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna enter in my Stripe API keys. So I've went ahead and I've created a brand new Stripe account for, uh, I've created a brand new Stripe account just for this training process, okay? And I want you to notice that my Stripe account is in test mode, okay? So um, whether you use yours in test mode, if it's in test mode, you won't be able to collect real money. If you wanna collect real money, then you don't want your Stripe account in test mode. You'll just click this button and then you'll turn it out of test mode and you'll get those keys there, okay? So everything's going to be the same. Like I said, right now, my account's in test mode because we're just gonna do training, so I'm not gonna collect any real money for this training. But what you're gonna do is you're going to come down here inside your Stripe account. You're gonna to go to where it says developers. You're gonna click on these API keys and you're just gonna copy these API keys. So I'm gonna grab my publishable key here, and I'm gonna stick it where it says publishable key of Stripe, and then I'm gonna grab my secret token here, my secret key, and I'm gonna stick it in Invoicing You where it says secret key of Stripe. And then I'm gonna go ahead and submit this, and now my Stripe account is actually connected, and I'm ready to go. So for, for you, if you wanna test things out, you can go in and just switch things into test mode, and put in your, your test API keys. And once you're actually, once you're ready to go into live mode and actually start getting you know real money and collecting real money, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna want to edit your keys and you're gonna wanna go back into Stripe and you're gonna wanna make sure that you're actually in live mode. Uh, and I'll, I'll just switch to a different Stripe account so that you can see you're going to, you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you're actually in live mode, just like I am right now. So if you click on this, you're in test mode. If you click on this, you're in live mode, and you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna grab your publishable key, you're gonna grab your secret key, and you're just going to overwrite them in here, and then you're gonna save this information so that, so that you can actually collect real money, okay? Uh, so to collect real money and actually get real money from your clients, you need to make sure that you're using your live keys and not your test keys. For the purpose of this training, we're just going to actually use uh, the, the test keys because we're not gonna collect any real money, but everything's gonna be able to, we're gonna be able to set everything up and do everything that we need to do inside this test mode. Uh, we just won't actually have to spend real money during the test, all right? So now that you have all this done, you've got this saved, you're actually connected, and you're almost ready to go. And the next in the next video, we're going to go go through the other little configuration things that you're going to want to do to go ahead and get started.